All right, guys, so welcome back. Today, we finally return to the world of Assassin's Creed Origins. Now, I know it's been a couple of days since our first episode of this game, but honestly, I just wanted you guys to watch the full episode as a whole before we started on with the series full speed ahead. And what's great about it is that today is actually Father's Day. And this game, this story revolves pretty much about or around a father seeking revenge for what has happened to his son it's a very father-son bond type ish of story or at least from what we've gathered so far so i feel like it was actually a, a pretty pretty cool day to continue the series or officially ramp up the series now i will say i had to grind a little bit off camera i was a level five by now and, and these missions required me to be a level 11 or at least recommended and let me tell you just doing some of these like side missions to kind of level up it was extremely difficult like this game really really you have to grind it out and i don't know if i'm going to include the side missions as part of these episodes i don't know if i should i, I know the the game itself is pretty long so i i don't know what i should do with these episodes as far as like side missions i don't want it to drag for too long because you know the more episodes the less better they start performing because you know the longer it is or what have you um but i don't know what we'll do if you guys have recommendations as to what's the best way to level up, uh, please drop your tutorials down below. And uh, with that said, today we continue. So today we're starting off the episode by getting closer to the snake, which is the guy that we're supposed to behead, if you will. You know, behead the snake. No? Okay. Anyways, the first target is Gen Genadios or something like that. And I believe he is going to be one of the first individuals that we have to take care of before we kill the snake. Which, as we know, is responsible or at least has a big part in the plot as to what's happened to our beloved Bayek. I really do love the scenery of this game. Um, I don't know, man. I like Greek mythology. I'm a huge fan of Greek mythology. Um... But let me tell you, like, this and Odyssey are, like, neck and neck because the scenery, some of the sceneries that I've, like, gone through as I've been doing these side missions have been insane. Like, literally insane. Uh, but anyways, here we are. I think this is where our target is. Oh, he's right there. Ooh, hold on. And here I thought, thinking I was going to have to go inside this fort and clear it out. But I was wrong. I stand corrected. By the way, happy Father's Day. I don't know if I mentioned that in the beginning. Uh, huge, huge happy Father's Day to all the great dads out there. I, I see you. You keep doing you, boo-boo. You understand? You keep being a great dad. I don't know if this is a risk. <laughs> Assume normal duties, man. I'm off to search the dogs for the madras. Oh, look at this. Okay, there's nobody here, right? Gennadio, sir. A soldier from the house to house search has disappeared. Oh! How'd they see me? Oh. Well, that doesn't matter anymore, does it? Why have you dragged me into the land of the dead? You sought to kill my wife. Your whore of a wife is a murderess, waifly and wanton. I did my duty as a Philagetai, and for this, you have taken my life. Is your vengeance above all law, Medjai? Be warned. The Philagetes will hunt you down and exact revenge. May the Hidden One walk beside you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. Yo, he's so fucking gangster, dude. Oh, I love this man, dude. Oh. There's something about Bayek. It's not that it's menacing, but it's... You got to respect them. So, Philakis, um are after you. They're powerful bounty hunters and will attack you on sight. Well, that's just fucking great. Oh, I got this bow that has now it's the first person view bow. I've never been a fan of them, honestly. I mean it's good. 
to take out like enemies from afar with headshots and stuff but that's pretty much about it oh man that actually went a lot smoother than i anticipated i can guarantee you this if i would have not um looted and killed some animals to upgrade my gear and done side missions that would have been impossible okay so we do have this fort here which i think i'm gonna do kill the captain at least hey wait uh -huh. there. Oh my god One thing that I think I should do with this game Is honestly not slack When it comes to Like what I should be doing You know I feel like if I slack it's only gonna bite me in the butt In the long run So that's the captain One out of two captains Let's see what do we have here? Who is that guy? Ooh, we got two chests there? Is that the loot? I think that's loot. In captivity. Hey now. What up, player? It feels so good when you're actually a recommended level. Like you don't You don't play with such fear. Cause when you're not dude, when you're not leveled high enough, you're 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 in a constant fear, constant anxiousness anxiousness of getting killed but it's so easy to die i'm telling you some of these side missions were kicking my ass but i am now bayek a man of wisdom and knowledge and most important power i've got the power to take a shower What up, big guy? Oh, that's what I want. I want some soldiers up in here. Come on. Enough of this sneaking around. Nonsense. I'm here to kick your ass. That's what I'm doing here. Hey, you know what? I take that back. That bow is insane. I take that back. You are free. You are no longer prisoners. You are free to go. Dude, that bow is insane. Dude, I take everything I said back about that bow. I mean, then again, the other bows are probably just as good. I don't know. I'm just having a good time with this bow right now. Oh, I think somebody spot me. Dude. And I'm getting all these freaking um extra XPs. I don't know if this is a side mission or something, but there's like prisoners here. Yo, this might be a side mission. Excuse me, sir. All right, so that's already the second command, the first commander. I need one more treasure. I'm gonna call upon Senu. Let's see where that treasure is. Uh, okay. Wait, where's the treasure? in here is it in here maybe upstairs what's going on with these guys bro these guys are crazy yeah it's definitely in here there it is excellent and these guys are freaking stacked Hell yeah. So we are now officially on our way to eliminate the snake. So one of the missions that it says 
that we have to complete so you guys have an understanding if we go to quest we have two main missions one is called aya which is or aya aya which is his wife and in order to complete this we have to assassinate both ganadios and the snake we already did one of them and now we're going to do end of the snake which is snake um so we're going to be tracking that of course and i'm going to call upon my camel and we're close by man we're very close by so we're gonna make a turn here look how beautiful this is dude like everything in this game is just the scenery is just incredible we're about to hit level 12 it's time to celebrate yes sir right, i'm gonna have to drop my camel here because obviously he can't climb walls that just that would be weird but i can so there's that i'm gonna use seno here and the snake is over there. Oh. This area is off limits. Okay, here we go. All right, so we're going to call Seno here. Here we go. There he is. Now we have to be careful. I should probably tag some of these guys. Just in case. Because if I don't. Look, there was just a guy there. How funny is that? <laughs> there was literally somebody just there. A couple coming up. Alright, it's time to be sneaky. Come here, buddy. You're about to die. Yes. Level 12, baby. These guys are level 12 as well. We've got an extra ability point, which we're going to use. But first, first, we got to take care of business. What? Dude, I literally pressed Y. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I don't have double assassination yet. And I'm assuming it's something that we unlock through ability points. But since we don't have it yet, I, I, I got to do things the old-fashioned way. Somebody saw me. Oh. Right, so far, so good. There's three treasures in here, which honestly, I'm not too worried about. He did. You did, bro. Bro, I actually love this fucking bow. This is insane. All right, I'm gonna go upstairs. Is he upstairs? Yes, he's upstairs. Oh, I love the design. Oh, fuck. They found a dead body. Okay, so who is the snake? Interact. Investigate These the progress. The, of the, royal scribe. the reign of Ptolemy Theos as recorded by the royal scribe. A ladder. Hmm. A ladder? Looks important. Looks hmm. important. Locked. I need a ladder. Oh, up there. Oh, so we will climb this. Oh, actually, hold on. We will climb here. 
You know, I oftentimes wish I had a library like this in my house. I feel like they're so cool. Oh, look at that. That's some Odyssey shit right there. God, change of plans. <laughs> change of plans. Well, that was much easier. A key. With a chest. Now we get his identity. Official papers. This chest belongs to the royal scribe himself, Eudorus. False bottom. A letter. Esteemed Ibis, the Pharaoh remains compliant and is our puppet in all things. Act with caution in Siwa. The murder of the Heron was but the first. Two from among us here in Alexandria have also been killed. However, the situation is under control. Canadios is actively questioning the populace. We commend your efforts, Ibis. Long life. Stamp to the seal of the snake. The snake is your daughter's. The royal scribe. Fuck that man. He dead now. I have said that the royal scribe is often at the bathhouse. I will kill that naked ear that you taught us there. So they're the ones, he's the one behind the, all the killing. <laughs> Alright, so let's take a look at the map because we might actually be able to get out of here. If we take a look at the map. Um, hold on. We go here. We can actually fast travel right here. I'm gonna fast travel So I think I remember the snake when I first played this game, which I didn't play a lot of it Obviously, I think I remember doing the snake mission and that's it And the thing is that I don't remember like 90% of the things that I've done I only remembered one of the side missions that I did off camera and obviously a little bit of the beginning of the game But that's it dude and again, I wasn't really like fully engaged into the game and it was a live stream and I just really wasn't in it. But man, I regret that. Is this where we gotta go? Is it in here? It is in here. Alright, it is time. Oh my god, this is hilarious. I love coming here. I pity the building alone is worth it. an endless source of Look up at that. Is everything you are lying, my lord? Simply the water is a bit tempting. Ptolemy is a chillless symptom. Simonides, you have consumed too much wine. Careful now. Here we go. Shut your ass. Up, sucker! Yes! Kick his ass! Oh, feels so good, you son of a bitch. Oh, what the fuck? Why? May the gods curse you. What cause of you to kill me? It was you who murdered my son before my eyes. You are a fool. At the temple, in Siwa. That forsaken shithole. I had nothing to do with that disaster. It is too late for your lies. Anubis awaits. 
Yo, that is sick. Worth the loss to slay the snake at last. The snake. The snake will never die. Oh, come on. Son of Apep. The Lord of the Duat awaits. Yo, he's so fucking cool. Eudoros killed. Oh, there he goes. He's been murdered. Shut up. Look at the blood. But he was so handsome. Eudoros, <laughs> poor soul. He was so handsome. I uh, actually know I'm handsome. You understand? I'm the handsome one around here. Look at this sexy body. My name is Bayek, the sexiest assassin of them all. Well, that's actually a close competition between Ezio and uh, and this guy. Well, I can't believe I, I feel this. I feel like I'm disrespecting the Assassin's Creed community. I forgot the name of uh, I'm blowing a brain fart right now. The guy from Unity. Fuck, I can't believe this. Arno, there we go. And oh, he's gonna burn his finger. <laughs> so obviously, this is the origins of using that hidden blade, and not where it came from, but like he didn't know that you gotta chop off your finger to because you'll lose it. Although eventually that was that became a thing that you didn't really have to. Oh, well, the assassin blade, the hidden blade, just went somewhere else. Um. But yeah, that was fucking nuts. So now we can go to our wife. <laughs> Maybe we can have some uh, makeup sex. Well, actually, there's nothing to make up about. Maybe we can have some... Uh... All right, I'm just going to shut up. We're going to go over there. We're going to be a good husband and tell her that we've avenged our son's death. Then we're going to find out that this is only the beginning of the end. Or the beginning of the beginning. Until we start the beginning of the end. And I'm making no sense. But hey... I've had a lot of caffeine today in the morning. Had a coffee. I've had two Diet Cokes. And um quite aware right now. Oh man, this must be a good time for them. Well, it's never a good time. Their son is dead, but they must feel really happy that they avenged their son's death. My dearest. There it is. That's what I like to see. Gennadios are dead. Man, I feel so bad for them. Doris, he died flailing in the baths. I wish I had been there. Oh, we are gonna have makeup sec. Oh, damn, Bayek. Man, you get it on all day. How do you have so much stamina, dude? My wife. My wife. I'm happy for them, man. I like I like that the duo in this game is literally a husband and wife. I think that's super cool. They've probably lit that up because the snake is dead. I'm not sure. Level 13. Let's go. Wait, did we hit level 13? I think we did. Oh. Or level 12. I don't know anymore. D. Hey, I was wondering if I should pull you out. Your adrenaline and BP are elevated, and it's affecting your heart rate and hormonal markings. Serotonin and oxytocin in particular. What happened in there? Aya's here. Who's Aya? Bayek's wife. I could feel her nearby. Oh. You feel her? Pretty sure that's the bleeding effect. Along with Bayek's memories, you're, you're also experiencing his emotions. No, you dork. I think she's actually in this cave. Spouses usually share the same tomb. A second mummy? We should really report to Abstergo. Maybe no. after I find Aya. I I'm gonna call it in if you don't. Deanna, no. If you do their well, get no credit. They'll cut me out like always. <sighs> okay. There. What is it? The bleeding effect is leading me to Aya. Oh, oh look. great. <laughs> More fuel for your superhero complex. What oh, Easter egg. That's Bayek. She's down there. 
My turn for a leap of faith. Woohoo! What? <gasps> Yo, shut up. Only assassins would understand. Oh, why is her tomb down here just thrown like that? I was right. She's here. Oh, there you are. Thank God. <laughs> Whoa. I can almost taste the blood. Uh, uh, okay, you're making less and less sense, Leela. We need to report. Not yet. Not yet? So when? Well, I can't chew my way out of here. That's so sad, man. It's sad because you know that they're, that they're dead, you know? Obviously. It's like in Valhalla when you, when you saw... Uh, this guy's freaking dead body in the outside in the real world. It's pretty told. sad. What are you doing now? Climbing. <clears throat> and it's hard. So, Uskuti, will you? Fine. Let me know when you get to the top. <clears throat> Man, this game is freaking phenomenal, dude. This might be... It's too soon to say anything, and I say this a lot, but... Dude, so far this story is so fucking amazing. Oh, dude, I just love it. That's what that's what pulled me into Assassin's Creed too. The I'm whole. Back in. Why? I took a DNA sample from Maya. I want to see your memories. Look, I get that you're excited, but the more risks we take, the worse things could go for us. It's my dream on the line here. Let me do this my way. That's what pulled me into Assassin's Creed 2. The the story of Ezio and vengeance for his family, his brother, his father. It was a it was a it was a son avenging his father. And here is a father avenging his son, which is I love it, dude. I love it. I fucking love it. The genetic oh, sequencer like blueprint. Never got the creases out. Adding Aya's DNA to the chamber. It'll take time to sequence. You won't be able to sync with her memories right away. Layla, something else you should know. Since you're mixing gene sequences in an uncontrolled manner, the transition between memories will likely be unpredictable. I'm comfortable with unpredictability. Yeah? Well, I'm worried. You always are. That's funny. D never puts in enough snacks. Let's go, baby. So back as Bayek we go. I wonder if there's like a DLC for Aya. What is it? The snake. What if he was not the last? Of course he was the last. They are all dead. Justice is done. If there's any question, Apollodorus will know. He knows all. And where will I find this man who knows so much? He is with Cleopatra. But find his man first near the Hippodrome. Hey! <laughs> Get his finger, dude. I'll Crazy. tell Thanos that Gennadios is dead and meet you later. Dude, they better not kill her, bro. I will lose my shit. Enjoy the Hippodrome. Don't lose all your money at the races. 
to find Apollodorus. Okay, let's. I should have tracked that. <clears throat> We're gonna go to the main now, and Egypt's Majay. Majay? Majay. Yeah. <laughs> um, anyways, we got three ability points here. So we're going to see, look at this. This actually might come in handy. All right. I believe we have arrived. I'm going to call Seno here. See where this man is. Where is he? There he is. Perfect. Man, I cannot get over all these freaking places. Like Ubisoft really went all out with this shit. Like out of the three mythological Assassin's Creed games that we've had, <clears throat> excuse me, my favorite ones are Odyssey and this one. As far as scenery, not story, but scenery. What if we say Prasina has to win by two lengths? I am Bayek. Aya sent me to speak to Apollodorus. Shh. I'm sure you can appreciate that my master takes precautions concerning those he meets. I have a question only he can answer. I will tell him you seek his counsel and that Aya recommends you. Wait for tonight. If he sees fit to meet you, you will be found near the lighthouse then. But you say I'm Aya's wife. Oh, husband. Commemorating one of his <laughs> greatest racers. Plenty of drinking and festivities, along with the races themselves, of course. If that appeals. His name was Icarus, the glory of the Rocas Hippodrome. Much loaded and showed life. Okay, so what is the recommended level for this? I haven't even taken a look at that. Okay, it's it's, it's level twelve. Okay, so we are headed. Yeah, this is far, dude. What the hell? I need to know the name of these palm trees. I, I need to know. I want to put some of those in my house. They're not Sylvester's. They're, they're like a mix. I don't know. They're kind of cool. Pretty cool. All right. So I'm going to follow the road here. Let's get a move on. Let's get it going. Let's get it popping. I should probably uh, sync up there. Just in case I'll have to come here again eventually. Playing this game makes me want to play Odyssey again, and I don't know. I don't think I will do that because I already played it here on the channel a long time ago. Obviously, I, I feel like you know the videos have improved from 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 back then to now because I wasn't even a full Let's Play channel back then, so I kind of understand a, a Let's Play format better now. But I feel like um, I just still couldn't play that game all over again. It was so long. Um, unless there's like a new game plus, and I'm already like high leveled and stuff, then I probably would do that because I don't have to focus on side missions, but. Besides that, just being here all over again, it, it makes me want to, I don't know. Makes me want to replay it just because of how cool this shit is. But anyhow, before we do anything, I'm going to go up top and we're going to sync up. Hold up. Don't fall into the fire. <laughs> Seriously. Freaking heck, dude. I wish they would make like an Assassin's Creed 2 remake with like with these graphics, you know? And of course, a black flag. Okay, you, you can't you can't skip black flag. One of the greatest of all time. Okay, what? Oh, we got to All right. Got to pass some time. If this this guy comes at night. I think he said in the yeah, night, yeah. Oh. Apollodorus. You there? Are you here to kill me or to be my friend? Friend. Bike of Siwa. Ah. Then your help, please. You are Aya's Magi, huh? Any Magi. other survivors? Only Damastis. They took him prisoner. And the scroll? What of the scroll? Damastis had it. That ass Damastis should have destroyed it. 
Cleopatra owes you much. Can you get to a healer by yourself? <laughs> Shit. I've killed you, Doros. Huh? Well done. He was the snake, yes? Man to man, Bayek, there is much you have yet to understand. <laughs> man to man, I need an answer. Well, I must take the measure of you first. Rescue the masters and recover the scroll. And then I will know if you're the man that I acclaimed you to be. Yeah, listen here, bucko. Don't talk to me like that. I'll kill you. Where is this Damastis? He should be on the docks in Carnopos Harbor. I can't risk that someone reads the scroll he carries. Alright, so I'm gonna get Senu here. Oh, I think we... Oh, shit. We found them already. We'll find and rescue Damastis at Carnopos Harbor. Are you kidding me? Hey, hold on. Time is up. Mine now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, brother. This way. The next world. I have the bastards. Oh. Dude, what have I done? I can hit him. Dude. Oh. Alright, that's it. That's fine. Everything's totally under control. Oh my goodness. Yo, I freaking bumped the ship with their ship and I screwed everything up. This should have gone much, much smoother <laughs> than it's been going. This has been terrible. Perfect. We got this. I got him. Bro, come on, dude. What the hell did I just do? That was so sloppy. I have to sleep in my own Jesus. bed in here. <laughs> Thank you. It was very unpleasant in there. You have killed them all. Bastards, they deserve to die. Get me to a safe place. Then we will talk. Escort. Okay, so escort this guy to safety. Okay, so how about you get on my sh my little boat? Wait, where's my little boat? You see, I came on a boat, man. And on although I screwed everything up. Okay, so apparently he's not going to follow me. I'm not I, I'm not escorting him. He's escorting me, as you can see. <laughs> okay. Sure. We'll, we'll play by your rules then. to kill all of them that damn cage was too hard to get out of his own oh. yeah sure dude whatever you say all right let's talk come on speak to me apollodorus sent me to help you give me the scroll scroll i do not have any scroll your job was to carry it i hid it on our ship i did not want it to fall into the wrong hands where you is the ship there, everyone. at the bottom of the lake they sank it ah very well I will get it. Apollodorus is waiting for you at the lighthouse. I will tell him to find you near the sunken ship. To find and retrieve the scroll. Mission complete. Oh no, we gotta find it now. So, okay. Let me take this. So is it on the island? Yeah, it's on the lake over there. Let's call Sano here. 
Oh, it's actually here. I thought there was going to be like a separate lake over there or something. Where's this thing? Oh. There it is. There it is. Perfect. Oh, it's right here, man. Down we go. Oh shit. This right here is giving me uh, black flag vibes all day long. All right, perfect. We got the scroll. Let's, let's get the fuck out of here. You see how the light bounces? Look at that. Oh, that's so sick. All right, I'm gonna get back on this little, sh little. I don't, I don't know what to call this. Sailboat? Yeah, maybe. All right, now we gotta give the scroll to Apollodorus, and maybe then he can give us some information as to who else might be responsible. The death of our son. Here's your precious papyrus. Well done, Bayek. I see you are a capable man. Someone I may be able to trust. Uh, well, duh. The scroll was meant for the Roman general Pompey in an effort to sway Rome to Cleopatra's side. She will be grateful to you for keeping the communication secret. She is at my estate. We're headed there now. Oh. How does Aya fit into all this? Her cousin Phanos informed me that she was a driven woman stalking deadly prey. It so happened that I also had reason to bring down this prey. When Aya was successful, I stepped in to protect her. We are grateful. And we are grateful that you have eliminated Eudorus. He was an odious individual. I should tell you that in addition to Eudorus, I put an end to the black eye of Alexander, Gennadios. Gennadios? I am very glad he is dead. But it will cause serious problems for you. The Falakis are a tightly bound group. And murderers. They will certainly come after you. So be it. So be I it. ask why you wanted Eudorus dead? As you know, Cleopatra's brother, Ptolemy, is too young and pliable to be a strong leader. We believe Eudorus was the force behind Ptolemy, responsible for so many of Egypt's current ills. Here we are. The villa is up ahead. Oh. We will learn more at the villa. The queen enjoys the life of high society. I'm pleased that Aya is bringing some sober substance to Cleopatra's social circle. <laughs> she is an extraordinary woman, your wife. Hey, 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 I hey. Bayek. Before I can disclose all secrets, Cleopatra must meet and approve of you. She can be particular. Let me give you some advice. When you approach the queen, bend your knee in deference. Speak only in reply. Yours is not to question, but to answer. Do not be distracted by the festivities. She has a large entourage, and they like to amuse themselves. Sometimes to excess. Speak clearly, in measured tones, and above all, do not meet her gaze. Yeah, you got it, man. Ready? So many similarities I with this game wait. in Odyssey, it's crazy. <laughs> Catch me! Catch me! Come here, both of you! Yes! She I'm caught me with you. her husband. The sensation is most delightful. This way. Oh, don't do it. She doesn't hold the ground. Be. Where is my opium pipe? I will sleep with anyone as long as they agree to be executed in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> like Xanthivis. He was well satisfied with his bargain. Who is this toothsome fellow? In Mehoto Ek My queen, this is, uh... Well? It is a generous offer. But I have already pledged my life to this woman. 
Aya, you have chosen well. Come, we have much to discuss. Damn, my boy didn't Celebrate even knee him down. He, he, he did literally nothing <laughs> of what this guy told us to do. <laughs> ah, Pasheremta. Meet Aya and Bayek. They put an early end to Eudoros. Delightful. You are joining our efforts then? We do not know what your efforts are. Eudorus was a member of the Order of Ancients. They are responsible for my exile. They tore me from my throne. And why should I care about them? Well, the snake has many heads. Those heads make up the Order. The snake is the man who killed my son. It is not so simple. What are they talking about? I don't know. They must know something. The Order of Ancients seeks to control all Egypt. Ptolemy is but their puppet. Order of Ancients, we this have is where they introduce in it. Each region, but they have been unable to touch the order. Across Egypt, mysterious forces work against us. For instance, here in the Nile Delta, the endless sands swallow up whole villages, yet a malignant human force moves with them. That force is one of the Order of Ancients called the Scarab. And over here in most sacred Giza. A shadowy figure called the Hyena controls all that occurs. What is certain is that Giza is the land of death and loss. And then there's Memphis. All is cast in my land. Even the sacred Apis bull himself. The one called the Lizard has worked a sort of diabolical power. Hmm. So the snake is the Order of Ancients? Yes. <laughs> Eudorus was known as the Hippo. Oh, wow. You are right, my love. <sniffs> he was not the last one. All of these are. When the Order wants something, as in Siwa, it does not hesitate to crush all in its path. Wow. For Siwa, now Fayum, it is the most oppressed region in all of Egypt. Where the crocodile wields cruel power, the denizens live in constant fear. That is the fate that awaits all Egypt if we fail to stop the order. Oh, shit. That was the sun. We need decisive action. It is time for assassinations. We still have not found the man who killed Remu. Wow, are you kidding me? Our sunshed will weep with joy when we clear the map of those figures. You are my Magi now. Protector of the true Pharaoh of Egypt. So it shall be. Tonight, we drink, <laughs> celebrate, make love. Tomorrow. Dude. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck. This is so dope. Golden Medje badge quest item. So travel to Giza. Suggest a level 20. Jesus Christ. Okay, so we got level 15, which we could do that. Um level 25. See, this is what I'm talking about, man. So many damn high level missions here. What the fuck? <clears throat> okay, so we just got introduced to the Wait, it's not here. The targets. 
Okay. So we have... Oh, but there's... Oh, these are the ones we killed already, right? No, we haven't killed the ram. Did we kill the ram? I know we did these three here. No, we did uh, the hippo. The ibis. I think we did. We got... There's got to be more. There's probably going to be more. Um, so right now we got four. We've got the scarab, the hyena, the crocodile, the lizard. So I've, I've heard from multiple people that Bayek is the one that created the uh, the assassins, like the creed, if you will, or something like that. I haven't really looked too much into it. If you guys can let me know in the comments, obviously considering this is the origins of Assassin's Creed and how it got created. I don't know if he's, I don't think he's created it yet in the story itself, but eventually he does. The Brotherhood, better yet. Um, that's what I've heard from multiple people, but I'm not sure. Um, which is honestly one of the things that's really made me want to play this game. Uh, but anyways, the Scarab Sting. It's a thousand meters away. Where the hell is this place? Oh my god, are you kidding me? So we gotta go all the way over there. We've got the Hungry River. I think we can do that one, honestly. We could probably do that one. So I'm gonna pin it. Oh no. I'll pin that. I'm gonna call my camel. We're gonna get to work. Now, obviously, there's probably gonna be some side missions I'm gonna have to do. I don't think I'll have to do them in this episode just because we've been recording already for some time. Um, but definitely, I'm gonna wait to see what you guys tell me if I should include some of these side missions in the videos. Because I've read that the side missions actually give you like a big closure to the main story, uh, the main story overall. It's not like pointless side missions. A lot of the side missions have to do with with the main story, or so I've read in the comments. Um, so yeah, just let me know and, and we'll see. Before recording this episode, like I told you, I had to. Oh shit. I had to play for like two hours, literally just grinding some side missions because I was only level five and the, the, the mission we had to do was level 11 recommended. So I don't know if I'm going to have to be doing that every time, but right, what the fuck is this? Can my camel go through here? <laughs> no. <laughs> No. <laughs> oh my god this is not what i had in mind i just killed my fucking mount all right guys relax chill this is not part of the plan can i call it again okay there he's he's alive thankfully unfortunately for us we have an immortal camel he's still got look he's got blood on his ass he definitely died, but he came back to life. Oh, that was fucking hilarious. Oh, look. We're going to need some of this to upgrade the gear. I had to hunt a lot, and I was actually searching it up. Not just do you have to level up, but upgrade your gear is extremely helpful. Oh, he's dead. Thank you. All right, so this place is... All right, check this out, guys. Okay, check this out. Let me kill this one. And then I'm going to kill that hippo because we're going to need some hard leather. Oh, there's two hippos. The hippos are actually pretty easy to kill. It's the crocodiles that scare me. Dude, this bull's so fucking strong, dude. All right, so there's another hippo over there. Take this hippo out. Right in the dome. No, that's no, that's not the dome. <laughs> uh, what's going on here? Let go of the fucking boat, dude. So that hippo was a level 13, so a bit more resilient than the last. I think I'm going to get off. We're relatively close anyways. The brewery closes at night, but Harkuf can be found at his home. So do we have to do, do this during the night or what? He's not. Oh, there he is. 
Okay, we're good. I seek the master brewer, Hakuf. I have no time. Speak to one of my overseers if you must. Mm. You misunderstand. I am a Magi. Apollodorus sent me. Apollodorus, of course. He sent me for the scarab, the shadow that darkens size. Shh, please. That is an evil name to speak aloud. Apollodorus knows that people are suffering. In my position, many confide in me. Trade is strangled, the soldiers run rampant, and the weight of Ptolemy's taxation crushes the breath from us. Come with me. Let us retire where we have a roof overhead. Oh, so now you want to help me, huh? Just because I said Apollodorus, now you want to be friendly? I had to kill you, bro. There are many terrible stories about the scarab. I am sure Apollodorus told you. Tales of mutilation, disappearances, and folk buried in the desert and left to die. A horrendous fate, trapped in the oh. shimmering sand, your mind and body pounded by the remorseless sun, waiting for the final release into the duat. But these Bells. are only stories. There are real villains in size, but the Scarab, if he exists, it is not safe to speak of him. Oh, secret entrance, huh? I like. Yo, this is crazy. The investigations of Harkov's agents. Concerns of the people. Ah, Saiz <clears throat> is no different than Siwa. You know, I share your concerns about uh, Safetu, but I believe a greater force directs him. This is the Scarab. Perhaps a mix of myth and rumor, but I think he exists. Uh -huh. I think he controls some of the Pharaoh's soldiers uh, through fear and greed. That is why I was tortured when I discovered a, a rich payment to the one uh, to one of the captains. They nearly killed me. I would have died after, their, uh, mut after they mutilated me. If they had not thrown me onto the road where Taharak Taharaka uh, found me and brought me home. Hmm. The disappearance uh, in the night. Two men disappeared in the night uh, last year. They were known um, in Alexandria as powerful pro uh, providence of Cleopatra. Their families were in size. But have since fled. Oh. So what is this here? Conflicts of interest. Okay, so if I accept these, I have to see if these are considered main missions. Hold on. The last man who asked questions about the scarab was near beaten to death. With his tongue cut out. Who was he? Old Cooper, father in law to the most powerful man in the region, Tahaka. That boy, Kawab, is his grandson. Dude, that sword is so cool. <laughs> Holy crap. Tired of winning. <clears throat> I'm looking for your grandfather. Do you know where he went? No. He left on the road to Camp Piros. He should have been home by now. I'll see if I can find him along the road. Hmm. Alright, so find and rescue Gupa. Alright, so let's take a look. Let's see these quests that I just approved of. Are they main? They're not. They're side quests. But these are going to help me. Oh, for sure. Those are definitely going to help me level up. And considering the origins of where we found them, I, I do think they're going to be relatively uh, close to the main story of what's going on here. So those are probably going to be missions that I'm going to have to include just because. All right. <clears throat> Let's see here. 
Asano. Oh, there's a fort right here. In captivity. Oh, they have this dude capped. Oh. Bro, he's literally right around the block. What are you guys doing? Alright, it's time to kill some assholes here. These are level 15, so. Can't be fucking around. Alright, let's see. What are we to do with <gasps> Well, he didn't see me, right? No, he did not. Okay, let's see. Do we have let's tag these guys? Okay, 16 and 15. Oh my god. There's some arrows here. Okay, how many arrows do I have? Four out of four. Oh, this bow only has four arrows. Please do not. Oh my god. I might have to burn the place. It might be my best bet. How did he see me? Bro, this is fucking crazy. This guy's gonna go call for reinforcement. Will you stop? Set trap. Go, go, go. There's a trap there. Okay. But we got the big guy out. I feel a little bit better now. Come on, come on. Come on. Dude, they touch me and I lose 23% of my health. That dude literally just pushed me. Come on. Fuck. Jesus. Mind you, these guys are two levels higher than me. And it's like, my goodness. Okay, I know I gotta free that guy, but hold on. There's a, I think there's a chest here somewhere. Let me see. Is there a chest here? Yep, there it is. Let me get some arrows just in case. Oh, I'm full. Yeah, I'm full. Oh, look at that. Is that it? Okay, location completed. We could have just probably freed this man, but I feel like that would have been much, much harder to do. So. Probably got to carry him. He's all banged up. Yeah, we definitely did the right thing by clearing this area first. There's no way we would have been able to get this guy out of here. And hey, I'm not even going to lie. Killing those hyenas and lions wouldn't be a bad idea. But imagine clearing out this camp and then dying to the lions. That would really suck. All right, so I'm going to place this dude back here. And we're going to get the hell out. I know this Garab took your tongue, but we can help each other. Akuf told me that you are investigating this Garab. Help me, and I can ensure he dies. All right, I'm going to sync up here, guys, real quick. Whoa. Um, I don't know when, when we'll be able to come back here again, or when we'll have to come back here again, but... My love... Oh, fuck. It's a letter. Let's sync up. God, that mission was so irritating. So I leveled up high enough to where I could do this episode, like, you know, nice and smooth. And everything went perfect. And then we got to this point, this last mission, and it was like, holy crap. I saw carry Chuba back to his home. I honestly thought I was going to have to, like, end the video here. Because I wasn't going to be able to do that without doing some side quests. But, yeah. I'm obviously going to cut some stuff out. But it took me like six, seven tries. That was uh, that was pretty brutal. And and the funny thing about that is it was only like nine guards. It wasn't even like a fort. If it was a fort, I, I probably wouldn't have been able to finish the video. They are his eyes. Okay, so we're level 14 now. We also got some craftable items. Um, we can do some upgrades. I just heard. So the future is bright. 
Let's see. Grandfather! Are you alright? Is he hurt? Banged up, bruised, and thirsty. The soldiers did not take kindly to him, but he will be alright. Where's your father, Kawap? We must speak of this. Father is away. On ah. his great work. <laughs> Mother! Grandfather is hurt. Soldiers mistook him for a beggar again. Father! What have you done this time? He was searching for this scarab. I hope he can help me. And in return, I can protect your family. The scarab is nonsense. Everyone knows this. He wants you to read them. Remember, he can't talk. He's mute. Uh, it looks like this scarab is summoning warriors to the city of Letopolis. By the gods, that is where my husband is. Well, the city oh. is followed by the desert. It is father's destiny to rebuild it. We're going to join him soon. Right, mother? Yes. My husband, Tahaka, has been slaving there for months. I'm sure he can help you. He knows everyone there. If you go, tell him I can't wait to see him. Oh. Uh, of course I will, Kawab. 